Okay, so this is video B29 part two. Um, at the end of the last video, my answer was really weird and I couldn't figure out what I did wrong. And to be honest with you, I kind of panicked. I was feeling so terrible. So here's the fix. There isn't a fix, I was completely fine. All right, let's look at all our stuff here. So we were doing this, and I did read the question completely correctly, but we did it in a wonky way. All right, so we left the money in the account as described. So we said, how long were we going to take to go from $12,000 to $15,000, which is what is on here, exactly what I was showing you in the other one, A over P, we divide that, oh, get that out of there. 1.25 and we got this answer and I panicked because I was looking at the answer down here about five years and nine months well what I wasn't realizing is yes this is months and it took five years to get to the 12,000 and then it took another 8.55 months or nine months to get there. So I was right. It wasn't months. It was just this extra part. I hadn't included the five years. The other way to interpret the question, hold on, I need another piece of paper. Put that over there. Okay. And probably what make would make more sense or easier to understand is that your A, you see that? Yeah, you can see that. Is equal to 15,000. And my P, let's go back to using the 250 or $2,500. And then the I is still going to be the same as here 0 0.026417. And the N is what I don't know. So N is equal to log. A over P over log 1 plus I. And if we do this, um, A was 15,000 over 2,500 over log 1 plus 0 0.026. Four one seven. When you divide that out, it's six. You divide this log like one point zero two six four one seven. Um, yeah, log six divide by log like one point zero two four. Oops, I'm going to go back to 6417. All right, then you get n is equal to 68 point whatever, 69 months, which is exactly what the answer key said. So both ways were right. I just, honestly, folks had kind of a minor panic attack in there. And uh, yeah, so. Maybe I'd do better not having the answer key with me. Thanks for the second video.